Hey, you guys. So, today I decided to uh, do the same thing, thing today that I did on yesterday, which was totally out of my uh, character. First of all, to be outside doing my lunch, and then secondly, in the heat, that's another thing that's like totally out of my element. I don't like the heat, I don't like outside. I was just eating my lunch and flies was coming by trying to get some of my food and I was like, uh-uh, this is not the business. But uh, whatever. So I'm out here at the park and I just figured I'll stroll along and talk to you guys. Um. Just share a little bit of me. As I see people just, you know, with their families and friends and, you know, just enjoying life. I'm not sure these are, these are tourists, probably tourists, enjoying the, you know, New York City. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so if you did not check my video out on yesterday, um, my first time yesterday was actually coming out here and just exploring the outside during my lunch. And so that's what I did. So if you wanted to see how that went, you can check that out um, on my page. And you can also subscribe if you like as well. That's up to you. You know, but actually this is sort of fun for me. Actually, so... If you don't watch it, I'll watch it. But you know, whatever. So, uh, let me see. Today, interesting thing, while I was getting, I was on my way to work, and I took the subway. And so as I was taking the subway to work, I was just sitting there waiting, and a thought came to my mind. Thoughts come to my mind all the time. But a thought came to my mind today. And the thought was, it's interesting how there's so many human beings on the earth, so many different colors and shades, so many different heights and widths, but there's one thing that each human being has for the most part, unless they have a disability or, um, you know, something like that. And that is two eyes, a nose, a mouth, teeth, two hands, two arms, two legs, two feet, or two foot, whatever. <laughs> and um, yeah, all of us have those same uh, parts on our, on our body. But yet it's still, all of us look different. And I think that is just so interesting how so many different variations can be made of the same amount of parts. I mean, to the point where twins, even though they're created to be identical, they still have differences. And so with those differences, I just think it is so interesting on how that happened. And then secondly, why that is so important. And um, I don't know if you're anything like me, but sometimes I just ponder on things like that. And in the climate of our world right now, it's like everyone is fighting so hard to be special to be considered as important, to be considered as the superior race or the superior ethnicity or the superior uh, majority that needs to be paid attention to, that needs to be looked at, that needs to be taken care of, all of those things. And it's like, in my mind, I feel like every human being that has been created is important. Every human being that has been created, there was a specific 
purpose created for. There were specific genetics given to. There were specific features made available for. And I just wish sometimes that we would look at human life as valuable as the creator looked at human life. Um, I know that there may be some that might watch this video and say that they don't believe in a creator. And if you don't, that's your business. I can't, you know, fault you for that. And hopefully you don't fault me for, for believing in one. But based off of my belief, so much energy was put into creating each and every human being that is on this planet that I think it really saddens the creator in which I believe when we consider one life more valuable than the other, regardless of where we may come from. Uh, we're all human beings at the end of the day and he cares for all of us, every last one of us, be it white, yellow, blue, green. I don't think there's no green people, but you get my drift. And so, I don't know. I mean, and I have to be transparent myself and say that there are times, excuse me, where I make it my business to bring celebration to my blackness and that I'm a black girl. And that is not to downplay the beauty of another ethnicity <clears throat> at all. It's more so to just bring or give encouragement to those that may not seem to get much encouragement or recognition or things of that nature, such as myself. Um, but I don't know if that has ever been misgrewed as feeling as though I'm better than another human being, but that's never the case at all. But uh, hopefully this video was not too deep. But I just, you know, just pouring my heart out and just sharing with you my thoughts on things. Sometimes you really can't tell people what you're feeling or what you're thinking because everybody don't necessarily agree. And um, right now, our world is really, really tensed and stressed out and we're continuing to use the same thing that we've always used which is color classes sex and it's really really sad to me um as i walk out here i see all different types of ethnicities some more than others but i see all types and at the end of the day if something wants to happen to us, we would all need the same thing. If, if there was a shooting that takes, takes place out here while we're out here walking in the park, for someone to be shot and possibly survive, nine times out of ten, there's going to be some type of organ that may be needed or some type of assistance that may be needed. That is all human beings need. Um, and so I say that to say that we all need each other. We all need each other in some capacity. And many levels and classes will be accepted as okay if love and respect and appreciation were shown for all classes of people because we're all important. No, we may not all be rich. No, we may not all be educated. No, we may not all be small. No, we may not all be fat. No, we may not all have long hair. No, we may not all have short hair. No, we may not all be pretty. No, we may not all be ugly. No, we may not all be athletically inclined. No, we may not be all <clears throat> fashionable. I can go on and on on the different comparisons between what some people are and some people are not. But one thing that I do know is that we're all considered important to God and I think that we need to learn how to see God's in each 
in every one of ourselves. And I definitely believe that that would help us to respect each other more, to love each other more, to esteem each other more, and just realize that we're all in this fight called life together. And if we destroy one over the other, we don't benefit. Because if we destroy each other, there's not gonna be any of us left. <clears throat> so that's pretty much my video for today. Hopefully it's not too deep. Uh, I'll give you guys a little view since, uh, actually I can't do that the way that I did this video today, but that's fine. I'll give y'all a video tomorrow of some of the spots out here. But anyway, love you guys. And uh, y'all have an awesome, awesome, awesome. Sorry the sun is in my face. But have an awesome, 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 awesome day.